we're at Tea Party, which is like this not very popular pasta spot at the sports center like in NUS. I think I came here a few times when I was a student. My colleagues actually have never came to this area before and the reason why we wanted to come here is because it's really hot these days so we wanted somewhere that had air con and somewhere that wasn't too crowded. I was like oh wait we haven't been to this place so we ended up coming here. They usually sell like pasta. I think they have some like western mains like chicken cutlet and like fish and chips but I've not tried it before. The food is pretty mediocre but I guess it's okay if you feel like eating cheap trashy Western food it's good for its price it's around six dollars so just got the chicken sausage egg yolk, and then I added like mushroom onto it Wow mine is like really fragrant it's a little overcooked but that's okay it's not al dente I think Caesarea is better than this. Not really. I don't know, I don't know. But Caesarea is a very like home. home Dude, Caesarea is literally microwave. Oh, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Even that dessert. Currently walking around the sports center which is like i think this is where like most of the ccas and like like all the clubs they usually have like their activities here okay over here you can see like there's a pool and then like behind me here you can see like the gyms but i think the gyms over here aren't open to public only like varsity level um, sports students are allowed to use the gym. So proud of myself because um, I managed to bring my colleagues to a nice place to eat and then after that my colleague managed to um, find out about the gym membership so he's pretty happy about that. So yes, I should have brought them to this area sooner but I didn't because like why would you come here randomly for lunch? <laughs> We're at the pool! Yay! Okay, this is your first time at the pool, right? Uh, here, yes, yeah. but not, not in general. Do you like swimming? I don't really like swimming. <laughs> if I had to exercise, I would choose swimming. Oh, really? But I can't swim properly. I can only do the frog style. I cannot do all the other methods. I don't like swimming. I'm like a land and animal. I like floating. <laughs> You know, you can just like float. Oh, yeah, I like like fake swimming. Like you just hang out with like friends with like yeah, a float yeah. or something. But I don't like like actually swimming. I so. was like, yeah. getting ready because we're going to I think it's like Singapore's largest fair price which is newly open and it's located at the Clark Key Fort Canning area yeah so I'm just getting ready I'm using the usual products There's a few new things that I want to talk about. I recently got this new blush. It's from Rom An and it's in the shade, I think it's OD Milk or something, but it's basically like this really pale purple color. And the reason why I got it is because I watched Singles Inferno a few months ago and one of the contestants, Yoon, she has really nice blush. And then I saw this TikTok that said the way she applies her blush is very unique because she concentrates it at this triangular portion of your face and like she doesn't blend it out like she just leaves it there so I started doing that in my makeup routine I even got the shade that I think a lot of people are saying that she uses so she just like dabs it like right below the eye like that I used to put blush like on the side over here and I'll blend it out and I would use like a very red type of blush. I think if you watch my old videos, you probably saw. I recently ordered a package because I had my pre-wedding shoot like a few days ago and I learned a lot from the makeup artist that was doing my makeup. One of the products that she used 
like I asked her about it and it's basically like this base slash moisturizer product that she puts before your whole makeup routine. Unfortunately, I just got the package so I didn't open it yet. Uh, so I didn't get to use it in today's makeup routine but I will show you guys next time. It's the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enriched Face Base. What this does, she said it's like pretty famous amongst like all the makeup artists. It evens out your complexion and it also helps moisturize your face so that when you put foundation on or like any sort of concealer, it's supposed to like glide on really nicely. I also got like their cleansing oil. It came with like a few samples which was really nice. They gave me this mini lipstick, also a travel size version of the cleansing oil.
and it's cold water. That's so it's cool. Like it's cool. Wow. Wow, it really is. You can adjust the temperature using this. Wow. me on the this toilet cleaner. <laughs> so my friend recommended me to get this toilet cleaner and after I changed to this toilet cleaner like I never have to scrub my toilet. So you guys should try this toilet cleaner. Please sponsor us. Hello. Hi. Hi. What are your names? <laughs> Natasha and Ben. Yes. Where are you? Where are our friends? Neil Yay! Who's the friend? Me! <laughs> Yay! So what are you up to currently? Uh, Drinking water from the like new machine. Okay. It's really delicious, <laughs> artisanal, it looks and like exactly perfectly like chill. I can't tell from the cup. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit. Uh, yeah, they didn't have re like real cups yet. So. <laughs> Ooh. Well. Throwing shit on her horse. Yes. Megan, the exit's over there. <laughs> Hi, what's your name? Hi, my name is Junkie. Okay. Nice to meet you. Okay. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>